Today, we're going to rebuild these slide out beds and reinstall them on the Jayco pop-up. My thoughts were that since this plywood is rotted, that I was just going to slide the plywood out and replace the plywood. But no, the frame around these slide in beds are built around that plywood. So these frames have to be disassembled in order to get the plywood out. So the first step was removing all the little screws that screwed the plywood to the frame. I also tried to save all these little plastic spool looking things that were on the bottom of the bed. These spool looking things are for looping bungees from the canvas underneath the bed. I got to tell you, these things are pretty cheap to replace and you're going to wind up cracking about half of these little plastic spools trying to pry them off. Next up was to remove the rivets that hold the aluminum frame together. I'm only going to remove the rivets on one side and I'm going to drill them out using a 5 30 seconds drill bit. I decided to go ahead and repaint the aluminum frames while they were off, so I used some black Rust-Oleum paint to paint them a semi-gloss black. And then I also cut the plywood down to four foot by six foot to replace the rotted plywood. I slid the newly painted frame around the outside of the plywood and it was time to rivet it back together. I used an awl and a 5 30 seconds drill bit to help line up the old holes for the pop rivets. The major problem I had is I could not find 5 30 second pop rivets. I could find 3 16 pop rivets. So I had to wind up redrilling these holes for 3 16 and installing short 3 16 pop rivets. Once all the pop rivets were in place, next up was to install all the little short screws that screw the bed to the frame. I used new stainless steel screws for this application. And the final installation was this strip of wood that was right down the middle of the beds. I'm not sure if this wood strip is for support or to prevent the bottom of the bed from rubbing when you pull the bed out. Reinstalling these bed slides is a two-person job. It's hard to hold that awkward bed up while you're trying to get all the bolts and the holes to line up. On this pop-up, it had four bolts holding in the beds and the slides on the left and two bolts holding it together on the right. And these bolts are quarter 20, but they use a 7 16 socket and a wrench. And with everything tightened up, it was ready for the beds to slide in and out. And before you go pull in on these beds, make sure that your wheels are chocked because there's enough friction from these beds to move your pop up if it's not chocked right. Next up is to rebuild the top. And I know a lot of y'all have been waiting to see that. And the canvas is close to getting here. So we're looking forward to that as well. Thanks for watching. I've got more to come.